want to ruin these TV heads. Right. right there. They and, and already were ruined this weekend. I work at the <laughs> house, but that's okay. Work. All right. So this is going to be great. This is a, a and now I'm not going to make a karate chop, you know, big heavy boards, but I but there is a challenge to this. This is just like a, a ruler or a yardstick, you mm -hmm. know, so a local hardware store and and yeah, a yardstick or a same kind of wood. So here's what's going to happen if I ask you to put it right here and to karate chop it. What's going to happen? It's going to fly towards the camera. So you'd have to hold it down with something, correct? My hand. That's why. No, 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 no. Never allowed to hold with your hand. So that hand doesn't even get. This piece of newspaper will be perfect. All right. What? So just a silly little piece of newspaper, and we just set it what? right there. And now we do karate chopping power here. Now watch this. It's going to hold it right in place. Watch. Oh. Steve. See, we failed. <laughs> Complete yes. failure. All right. Miserably. So that's where, it, here, grab another sheet of newspaper. Okay. And what I want you to do, open it up. So the secret is to, to spread the out. <gasps> there you go. Now we need some surface area because what is pushing down on the newspaper? Air. Gravity. There you go. So air is pushing down on the newspaper. So if we kind of spread it out here like this and we're set. Good. Right. All right. So now here's what I want you to do. You're going to be about right here, and you're just going to give it a good karate chop, and let's see if the air pushing down the newspaper, and we'll figure out the air, if it works. If not, segment's over. But I, you know, about right there, hard. Ready? Three, I'm really two, nervous. one, karate chop the hard. Nice. Look yes. at this. Beautiful. Karate chopping power. <laughs> I this love is, it. Now, here's what happens here. Is that, look at, are you okay? Are yeah, I'm fine. No, we're good. Oh, okay. uh, <laughs> So, so look at what we have here. This is what, uh, I don't know, 20 by 30 inches, something like that. Right. If it were just an air pressure demonstration, uh, air pressure demonstration, they'd say it's about two tons of air pushing down on it. We know that's not the case. Yeah. Because it's not completely flat. So when we're here, and I, I try to get it about 20 inches or so off, or kind of a, um, a little set there. Right. Uh, when I hit it like this, as hard as I can, it's going to try to pick up and push against the air. And as it pushes against the air, okay, so stand back for a second. Let's okay. Just, I'll see if I'm as good as the karate chopper as you. Ready, mm -hmm. huh? Whoa! Nice. Even better. Look at this. It just gives you this yeah. great little chopping there. So not only on Martin Luther King Day are you going to have fun karate chopping, but your hand is going to hurt so much at the end of the day. <laughs> see how that works? I'm so excited for I that know. part, Steve. Thank it's you. air pressure. So here, grab one more of those. Okay. I put it up online because I wanted you to be able to see as we start talking about um, those properties of air and uh, and the force that's there. It just it's so hard for it to pick up the newspaper that it works. Tell them about the website, okay. and then you get one karate chopping yes. shot. Ready? Okay. Okay. Everything you need to know about this experiment and more of Steve's science experiments are going to be on our morning show webpage. Ready? Here we go. On 9 You can give it a karate chop. Ready? Ready? Uh, Hiya! Oh, that was nice. nice.